Kozarowski. This past week is why I love doing what I do. We were up to our necks in sports coverage and I saw so many great moments. As you know, I keep the plays of the week to the top five, but I quickly want to throw a couple of honorable mentions in there. And the first is from Mandan and Central. Dane Carlson heaves this one downfield, tight spiral, and he hits big man Elijah Klein. That is some arm strength right there. And then in Mandaree six-man football, Paul White Owl showing his arm for a 52-yard score against center Stanton. Now to the final five on my list. Fourth and goal from 15 out. Shiloh's Jaden Mitzel rolling out, and he wants to convert this. He's going to win the battle at the goal line for a touchdown against Grant County. Number four, earlier in the week, Mohal and Shiloh. Henry Savilkul laying out for a dandy of a catch to move the sticks. Mohal lands for Sherwood, would end up losing by two, but still a great haul. Number three on my list, Napoleon Gackle Streeter's Nathan Weigel putting the sauce on the defenders and cap it off with a dive into the end zone for the score. We got to check the defenders' ankles after that play. Number two, Cheyenne and Century, Tyler Turhark somehow is going to come down with this reception near the sideline, and here is how. He's able to tip the ball to himself and get a foot down with possession while heading out of bounds. And if it was for a touchdown, maybe it'd be number one. But my top play this week comes from Kidder County. Jonah Harder is going to be looking downfield, and Peyton Cawthon wins the battle for possession in the air, and he's off to the races for a touchdown. It's going to be worth seeing again as it's pretty good coverage, and the defender actually makes contact with the ball, but Cawthon maintains hand-eye coordination and wrestled it away. Great concentration, great play. And those are your plays of the week.